right. I'm taking you through what I'm doing today. Um, a little bit of ripe avocado. Some say a woman should have one avocado a day. I remember Kara saying that, Kara Brotman. And look at her, she's so strong and fit in her 50s or somewhere in, around that. I'm having a facial of my own um, gel that's made from Irish moss. Getting my feet in the earth and some sun in the afternoon here. My bare feet. And it's kind of, I was calling it Operation Cindy. I'm calling it to myself. I mean, I don't really want to make it public, but I feel like I got to do something. I got to just go through my day until I figure out what my channel is. And I am teaching polarity therapy, so it's actually, I live that way. I live polarity, so why not just go through what I'm doing each day? Thank you so much for being here and joining me. You can actually put, or I could, put the avocado on your face as well. And some blueberry. I had this amazing French esthetician lady tell me at the Monarch wedding in the woods of Oregon in 2009, yeah, put the blueberry and avocado on your face. And I don't do it. <laughs> it just seems so messy to wash it off. But I did put on, I started today, I haven't done that that often at all. Like, put the Irish moss on. going to do apple juice. I got a case of this um, from my co-op. So they're hard to find. Not none of the stores have them anymore. Thanks to you guys never buying them. <laughs> I just, I'll try being real. It's like nobody cares. They, they barely buy quarts of apple juice. That's three quarts. I'm going to put some banana. And then, so if you don't buy, what I'm getting at is if you don't, if people don't buy things, then the stores will stop buying them because they can't sell them. So, and then some Irish moss that I just made. I soaked it. I'll show you. I get this from Marcus and Kara. They, I'm not a distributor. They don't have distributors like that. It's called Irish moss and they no longer make these big bags. Thanks to you too, from not buying these because, because uh, partly the recession. So people are buying smaller amounts of things, but it was nice to get these big bags. They last a long time, but otherwise just get what they do have. They have the highest quality Irish moss. So that's marcusrothkrantz.com, Irish moss, sea moss. Those three things. And then I have some ooh la la, some tonic ingredients. I might just wait and have those in a latte because they're amazing. They're the mushroom extracts, the shilajit, and I had some today a little bit. I'm trying to follow the directions instead of glomming it all at once where I often I'll put a huge teaspoon in, but they really only call for half a teaspoon. So keeping in mind with, like we say, the economy and that I'm going to be teaching soon with, for, um, to become a teacher of craniosacral because I'm a teacher of polarity cranial, but not the biodynamic cranial yet as a teach as far as accredited. So I won't be making as much money. I'll be traveling and you can't really work while you're driving. Like, and so, yeah, I'm trying to keep that in mind while I'm doing any type of nutrition program. I have Irish moss on my face in case, oh, I better not have anything else on my face. Oh, gross. If so, I'll just use the audio, not the video part. Have a good day. To be continued. Okay, and frozen organic blueberries, organic banana, some organic apple juice with the Irish moss gel that I just made today. So here we go. nice. I'll tell you later more what the plan is and the strategy when my face is clean. But for now, just know that sometimes just stopping eating is a smart strategy. That's sometimes all you can do is just stop. Stop eating.